Ibrahim alayhi salam, as he was leaving his family, and by the way, no man can ever come today and say, I've just left my wife and children to fend for themselves because I'm just following the example of Ibrahim alayhi salam. I've actually had one case, I was uh, an arbitrator in a problem and the man was so, such a religious guy with such a nice, mashallah, you know, long bed and so on. Uh, I don't think he would miss the hajjud, but he actually told me that, look, Ibrahim alayhi salam did it, you know. I said, brother, are you a prophet of Allah? Did Allah instruct you to do something? Like there was another case where a guy comes up and says, you know, Ibrahim alayhi salam, uh, my father told me to divorce my wife. I don't have a problem with her, but I divorced her. So, but why? Because my father told me, I said, your father, you're a man on your own. I would inform my dad rather than ask him at this juncture. I mean, I'm close on to 60. Come on, guys. In a few years, a few decades, but my brothers, my sisters, I tell you, it's a fact of life. You are not a prophet. If Ibrahim alayhi salam, according to one narration, went to his, his son or he, he told the wife, you know what, tell the owner of the home that when he comes, he needs to change the, the doormat. So when Ismail alayhi salam heard about it, he said, that was my father telling me to divorce you and you can go home. That was a prophet of Allah. If at all that narration is correct, it was a prophet of Allah. Yes, indeed. And if a prophet is, is told by Allah, they wouldn't say something from their own pockets. But if your father comes to you and tells you to divorce someone you have no problem with, you love them, you tell your dad, goodbye, salam alaikum. And you walk towards your wife. So what if they call you whatever? You have taken her with the name of Allah. You don't do that. We, we love our parents. We will respect them. We will be kind to them. But never did Allah say, obey them when they are unreasonable. Not at all. One of, some of the difficulties we have today are based on the fact that sometimes we just follow what's unreasonable. We know. But we say, that's my father. I cannot replace him. That's my mother. I cannot replace her. But you, I can replace you. What a statement. What a fraud. What a blackmail. May Allah Almighty protect us.